Hi everyone, Tuesday night, Cairo 7 meteorologist Morgan Palmer. I want to give you an update going into the night. Now this is data that is going to be updated beyond midnight, so this is really valid for the few hours either side of, of midnight tonight on our rivers. The, the wind's done for western Washington. Plenty of folks without power. If you're one of them, I'm very sorry. Uh, it will take some time for that to recover. But you know, river flooding is a concern through the overnight. Lots of rivers in flood. This is a, just a very long list of rivers. Some that are of greatest concern through the overnight and into early tomorrow morning. Now we're looking first of all at the, at the Skykomish River near Gold Bar. Fortunately, it crested third highest level on record, finally falling below flood stage. Also, the Sultan River um, dammed up right there before it flows. Uh, into the main stem of the Skykomish and then into the Snohomish uh, is causing serious flooding in downtown Sultan this evening and into the early overnight hours we're covering that. Siliguamish River at Arlington. Uh, the crest, as I'm recording this at 10 o'clock on Tuesday night, I said this is a kind of a short-term video for us here on Facebook. Uh, possibly the third highest crest on record. We'll see how that uh, shakes out into the morning hours also. The Snohomish River uh, cresting in major flood stage, not record flooding or close to that though, but still very high. Cresting around 10 a.m. both at Monroe and at Snohomish. The Snohomish River at the city of Snohomish will fall below flood stage on Thursday morning. And the other in our metro area east of the Sound, the Snoqualmie River near the falls. Possible top 10 crest during the overnight hours. The falls are going to be raging. Also the Skokomish River uh, in major flood, but that's going to be uh, just right above major flood stage. And that's where it has been already this past week. Meteorologist Nick Allard will have you covered from 4.30 a.m. tomorrow on Cairo 7. So have a good night. Hopefully, uh, if you're without power and watching this on a phone, you get it back soon. All the best.